Man, what's good, what's good, what's good? Man, what's good with y'all beautiful people? It's your boy First Take J, aka Pure J, aka Spiritual J, aka Nature J. You know I'm out here in nature. It's 345, aka 345 in the morning. And I'm out here vibing. I'm out here in nature with it. Okay, young Kobe, man. That's whatever you want to call me, man. What's good? Man, what's good with y'all beautiful people? It's your boy First Take J. Man, I hope all is well. I'm on a spiritual journey, cruising on a spiritual journey, and I can't complain. All is well, you dig? Man. Hey, hold on one second. Let me take these. Take my phone on my damn hoodie. My headphones on me because I don't have as much range of motion. All right, y'all. What's good with y'all, though? As y'all can see, I'm literally pushing my luggage. I'm, I'm hauling ass right now, trying to make, trying to get to this train station, man, so I can, uh, I can catch this, uh, little train, this little train metro to, um, to Queens real quick. You know, Queens, I'm gonna hit BK. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit New York today. So, this is Sunday. Your boy off work today. As far as I know, they ain't sent me no updated schedule. So, you know, I'm about to just head to the city for a Sunday, enjoy my Sunday, you know, try to just catch some good vibes, see some beautiful women, hopefully eat some great vegan food, because I have yet. Man, I fucking been damn near fasting, yo. So, man, it's been a crazy last couple days, to say the least. That's all I'm gonna say, but, um, blessed i'm blessed beyond blessed because the call that i got just last uh was it last thursday or was it yeah i think it was last uh tuesday matter of fact or no it was yeah it was last tuesday last tuesday around like 10 o'clock get a call asking me hey What's the quickest time you can fly in? Like, when's the quickest you can fly into New York for this uh, for this project? Can you uh, come tomorrow, basically, is what she was insinuating. I'm like, and it's 10 o'clock. And what's, 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 so, what's so, so ironic about the numbers is she calls your boy at 10, 10, man. I, look, I just happened to look at my phone while I'm on a phone call with her. And she asking me, yeah, can you come to New York? I might you most definitely believe I can come to New York. What if it ain't ten, if it wasn't ten o'clock, I would have been you know headed to the airport. <laughs> but she's just like, okay, awesome. Well, let me see. Um, go go ahead and like confirm your flight or go look at flights. And I was just like, say less. I already you know, I already confirmed one for you. Make sure this works. It worked out for, her and boom, I was off to. Said I was off to New York literally the next day the next morning. So I, I didn't even go to sleep. I, uh, or actually, I'm capping. I went to sleep for three hours because I went to bed around like like 1.45 going on two, basically. And then I had my alarm set um, for, I think, 4.44. Yeah, so that's almost like three hours. So I had about like three hours pretty much. And I think I ended up getting up at like five. My flight was at, what, seven? So I end up getting up at like five. I don't leave the crib till like 5.45, bro. So I'm just like, damn. I'm low key cutting it close, but I'm still about to catch this flight. It ain't shit, you know what I'm saying? It ain't nothing to the boy. I do this. So get to the airport, boom, boom, boom. Catch my flight. Boom, I'm in New York with it. Actually, I'm lying. I had a fucking layover, man. Three hour layover in Charlotte, yo. Three hour fucking layover in Charlotte. I hit up two. I had two of my Charlotte honeys, of course. One was at work, the other one was just like, oh, I'm at home, uh, bored. And she's like, why you ain't hit me up earlier? Like, I, you should've told me I would've came and got you. Like, we could've kicked it for a couple hours at least, and then I just would've went through TSA and all that bullshit, and just, you know, went to my gate. But, needless to say, I fucking remember that. I was like, oh shit, shorty do stand fucking, let me hit her up real quick. But by the time I hit her up, man, like we was texting, and you know, about to get like the, about to get the pickup day going. She just like, or right, basically, I'm just like, man, it's, 
it's down there 11 my flight you know my flight is at one but uh you know you start boarding and shit like 30 minutes prior to or something so i'm just like i'll just wait this little cool hour and just say fuck it like it ain't the end of the world i'll be back in charlotte again you know what i'm saying i ain't about to I ain't about to be pressed to miss my work or miss my money over no pussy or, you know, get no head from a little bitch real quick. But, uh, yeah, I'll just catch that bitch on the next trip. You feel me? And she, she gonna definitely be on Super Go just because I spent her this time. You heard me? So, just a little game for y'all little boys, but, not little boys, but a little game for y'all niggas. You know what I'm saying? Y'all gods, I should say. Many gods, young gods, and gods. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, man. So finally hop in, flew into New York, get to my hotel. Had to take a hundred dollar Uber to get to my hotel. That was a crazy part, man. Had to take a hundred dollar Uber from the airport just to get to my fucking hotel, yo. And I bitch won a hundred. It was a hundred something. It was like a hundred twenty. I'm like, damn, just to drive 45 minutes? But that traffic, man, that New York traffic ain't no fucking joke, bro. So, I'm about to be in New York for another week or two, and then I take back off, and I'm probably going to end up flying. It's either going to work out two, one or two ways. I'm either going to come back to Atlanta for, like, shit, probably like a weekend, and then have to fly back out to Ohio, or I'll be able to come back to Ohio for, like, I mean, I'll be able to come back to Atlanta for, like, a week, maybe a little bit longer, and then I fly out to Ohio for my, um, I think on the 28th, I fly out to Ohio on the 28th for this project, <clears throat> and I'll be out there for like two weeks. Then after Ohio, I'ma uh, hit Cali for a month. So I'ma basically be out there until from September all the way until like mid-October, late October, more than likely. But yeah, man, your boy about to be on the road and shit. So I just had to, had to get right though, man. I had to get right. Just grateful, blessed for sure. Um, and New York, I'm, I'm just I'm excited to see what the city got to offer me. I can't wait to eat some vegan food though. Like I've been fasting for like three fucking days. All I've been doing is drinking water, man. I got some I got some pistachios, and I ain't gonna lie to y'all, man. I ain't gonna lie. It hasn't been a fast for three days. It's been about two and a half days because I had I had this shit, bro. I cheated. Cheated, man. I had some fucking dominoes. I was hungry as hell when I got off work um, that Wednesday. Man, I needed some fucking food, Joe. Because I was in the airport all day, and I feel like the airport don't have no fucking vegan food. Like, <laughs> you can get some sides and and make it a fucking make it a dish for you, but they don't have no actual vegan food. So that was the shitty part. So I really just and I'm used to fasting all day, so it's not like it was a mental battle or it was just mentally challenging or anything like that but after three four days <laughs> or a couple days even shit you niggas start getting your stomach be like shit we're a little hot meal that or we're we're some fruit at we're some electricity you feel me so i had to sneak some dominoes in real quick got a little medium pizza I ain't even eat all that bullshit man that's it. It's just like your body rejects it after a couple slices. It tastes good. But then, like, by that third, fourth slice, this shit just was too fucking salty, bro. And, like, I don't know if it's that. I don't know what the fuck it was. But, like, this shit was just entirely too salty, man. So I had to throw that shit away. I couldn't even eat all that shit, man. And it just made me think, like, these people still getting programmed by this goddamn food. <laughs> They still getting programmed by this damn food. Cause ain't no way I should have been feeling like that. You know what I'm saying? There's no way I should have been feeling like that. So yeah, your boy finally at the gas, or not the gas station, I'm finally at the train station. You know what I'm saying? So I'm about to, I'm about to hop on the train. Get feeling. Get one of these little trains real quick. Damn, why this shit 14? Uh.
But yeah, man, I'm going to uh, catch y'all on the next video. I'm going to make another video as soon as I get done, you know, burn my ticket or whatever. But I'm about to buy this ticket. I love y'all beautiful people. Y'all stay blessed. Y'all stay safe. Y'all stay knowledgeable. Stay gaining wisdom. Continue to seek knowledge every single day. Chase your purpose every single day and be the best version of you every single day. So with that being said, I love y'all beautiful people. I'm going to catch y'all on the next one. It's your boy First Take J, a.k.a. Ish, Pure J, a.k.a. Spiritual J, a.k.a. Nature J. Okay, y'all call me, man. That's whatever you want to call me, man. You see the, you see the boy? Hey, I love y'all beautiful people. I'm about to sign out. Book this little flight. I can't I said flight. I'm about to book this little weak-ass ticket. And then I'm off to BK in Queens. I'm about to go see what's up with the city. So, yeah, more more going to be in tune. You know, just stay tapped in. Stay locked in with your boy. And I'm going to definitely catch y'all on the next video. I'm going to probably drop like two, three more. So, Hey, y'all beautiful people, I'm signing out. Peace.